but you know it's my session for today so you have to perform along right? otherwise it's a gray sky with a black something that's me moving a little bit around that's not entertaining no you have to perform along and find your own way i just can show sometimes a little bit of what i have learned and you have to take it or leave it you know a little bending of the knees can even drop the heel toes up a little bit hip to the front take care of your standing leg a little bit because it's lubricating your kneecaps and so forth you know, your knee, knee joint this movement it's really good other side it's really helpful if you are in trouble with your knees try it out loosen up the shoulders rotation that's it that's my shaking now coming to awakening the chi sparrows and it's quite warm <laughs> and this awakening the chi is you you see it you can see it for yourself the the movement is fairly fast to grasp you know it's just a circle with your wrists inhaling and erecting your spine to the heaven exhaling a little bit more sitting lower hip to the front everything else is already internally no, it's feel while going down feel while coming up throughout your whole body and try to exhale completely try to inhale completely to your belly and then don't try just do it <laughs> let it breathe and exhale by itself and the next step would be get to know your monkey mind and then becoming friends with the hindrances becoming friends with your monkey mind we are not quietening the monkey mind 
Wow, even professionals are distributing this really wrong way. We are not quietening the mind. That would be absolutely stupid. That's the essence of stupidity. Because the monkey mind is, is necessary, which this uh, normally the... What's that? The smartness, it's planning, it's thinking. You need thinking, <laughs> you know. You're not a sponge head, you know. <laughs> you, you need this thing, thinking, but, but it's not the master. And that's what you have to learn. Let go of demanding think, thinking. You know? And let go of reactivity, but becoming more natural, you know, more to your heart. And then, and then, you might be able to feel the inner smile evolving. Inhale and relax to the heaven. And exhale, relax to the ground. And as I said, it's the form might look like it's always the same. But appreciate the differences. You know? So it's a, a way of learn to know yourself, your bodily feelings, your sensations, your thinking patterns, the nature. That's more what it's all about. Not being better than something and somebody not being, what's that, worse than somebody. You have to meditate, you have to start your own meditation practice to Train to become aware of your non-judgmental mind. You know? Enough talking.
if you like coming to moving like a tree slowly with your ne next breathing cycle while exhaling coming to the basic standing position how do you feel now Okay, really, the same, completely the same like last session. As I said, everything is changing, you are changing, weather is changing and even how you are performing the same form one week later. No? Hopefully you will learn something about yourself. So, it's not the same. If you think the form, I know it already. You, know, you have to empty emptying your cup. You, know, you have to focus inward. If you are uh, in need, grasping for new forms, new knowledge and something, new knowledge is okay, but not, 
but not the outer form. No. Then, if, if you like to follow along, you have to switch from the outer view and the wanting to the inner view and appreciation of what is there. No. So, the harmony of the five changing seasons is the same. It's called Wu Sing. And I read a lot this last week new stuff, and it's already uh, in the papers that a scholar of uh, Zhuangzi already mentioned it. It was for him Gubel Gu. You know? Stupid stuff. So it's, it's a little bit too drastically for me because I said last week I will examine, examine it a little bit deeper. But there is really caution, you have to be cautious with it, you know? Because the beginning of this five elements, which is wrong, but that was the beginning, you know? What is a human in need of? It needs wood, needs fire, it needs metal, it needs water. And it needs a need of earth, you know? nothing with interchanging and so forth. That's the, that was the beginning. And then they ca came up with this changing. I'm a friend of it, you know, but there it is a little bit too stiff, even if it's changing, because it's. Um, Numerology, you know, believing in in number magic. That's nothing I'm so comfortable with. There's something to two, three, and five, and so forth. But uh, you know, c you can find similes, but don't make a religion out of it. You know, so. And all this stuff, the Wu Xing, Qi, and Yin Yang, these three, you have to feel inside yourself and find the equivalence in these uh, patterns and being critical with them. That's the way you are learning. You are learning more about yourself. And don't try to force fitting into this uh, patterns. You know? Take the pattern if they are appropriate to what you are in uh, what you can feel inside yourself. And don't let this pattern fool you. And the more complex these patterns are becoming, you know, taking the I Jing and spreading this five seasons into 62. That's Gubble Gu. You know, you can play around with it if you like, but then you are astray from the way of inner feeling. You know, that, that might be a good sign if you are attracted by something that you are that that you are on the way of your monkey mind monkey mind likes to play that's okay you can, you can if if uh, as long as you are in knowledge that this is the way of the monkey mind you can play around with the 62 as long as you know it's just a playing around and you are not lifting it up to a religion that's of ut utmost importance because that's what I'm uh, getting in contact with you know, with 
other Qigong masters and so forth. That's no written in stone, this Wu Sing. And I'm really happy that there was already in, I think, in the university where Zhuang Si studied, there was a youngster which was really critical and it's in the papers, you know. So even in the country where it's coming from, it's a matter of debate. You know? So don't take it for granted find your own way that's all I can say I'm I'm attracted uh, anew by it because there might be something uh, to take out of you know to so I'm I'm playing a little bit around and I'm trying to find equivalences of this pattern and my feeling and how this might lead to an other understanding and so forth that's okay you know, but but uh, if there are discrepancies i will take good care of it you know but now let's perform it a little bit to the side other perspective maybe this way around and it's synchronized with your breathing you know? going down yes to coming up with the hands inhale going down that's water exhale inhale and exhale because that's also the timekeeper and it's mm, help it, it's helpful to get your inner organs more moving you know? inhale exhale inhale exhale that is heart warmth fire that's earth it's in the height of your stomach And that's metal. <sighs> and slow. Yes, and one and a half round, very slow.
How do you feel now? And the single whip will stay with us, I think, really one more month. Yes. Because it's also the same. You know, this, this, these forms are endless. Because really to switch your grasping for new to the awareness of the inner world, if you like, and then becoming better <laughs> with it. And then the grasping for something new will switch to an inner warmth, if you like. And that's the way to getting to know about yourself inside and your own key, key gong. You know, it's a practice. It's not I'm going to a session and that's good. I'm going to the yoga session. No, it's a yoga way. It's a Chinese yoga way. You know, know about your mind, your body. Br not bring, let them come to an equilibrium to harmony if you like in a natural way join mind and body and then the way to immortality is also with meditation that's the way naigong And if you are more on, on the path of a youngster, of a new one, you are more attracted by outer stuff, by, oh, how it's called, rituals and so forth. And these are the lower grottos. You know, the middle grotto is already with uh, movements and the highest grotto is meditation. That's what the higher grotto is all about. As long as I can find out in my research. That's it. Collecting the chi. And a brief look into the chat. And thank you for performing with me alone, really. Now collecting my stuff, one brief look. Yo. Ah. 
Running nose. Uh. Hey, Swissa. Hello. Greetings. Really appreciate the change and staying with these forms. At least it's my way and as I can research, that's the way. No, not always searching for new forms. Of course, of course, in the first years you have to develop your own meditation practice. You have to, you don't have to do anything. If you don't like to, don't do it. You know, but know about your eating patterns, the stuff you are stuffing inside yourself, your sleeping hygiene, and this meditation practice. These are of utmost, Im utmost importance, really. And then learning at least what I'm teaching in forms, in these outer forms, and the Beijing form is really in the Tai Chi studio. It might be taught in two and a half years. On the meadow, we are taking three years, and that's the ordinary time frame, you know, because uh, you might be able to uh, remember these forms uh, faster, but the main goal is the switching from the outer awareness to your inner world while performing these forms. Because that's, uh, that's the yoga, yoga, bringing together your mind and your body in a comfortable way, slowly, and that's where your health is coming from. Qigong. Qigong Tai Chi. Thank you for participating, for performing along. Until next Saturday in German, 1 p.m. And next Wednesday 1 p.m. and one more time, thank you Swiss R for greeting. <laughs> and develop your inner smile. If you if you really in need of a goal, that's the there are the Brahma Viharas, love, compassion. Equanimity, joy, something, Mitgefühl, uh, Mitfreude, uh, being happy with uh, if somebody. Uh, I don't know if Inside Timer likes it. Uh, I can, I can try. I can try it. But uh, I have to uh, take contact, uh, get in contact with the Inside Timer people because this uh, live streaming is only for yoga, you know, for yoga masters. And this is Qigong. I don't know if they like it. But as long as you are watching, that's one of 100. <laughs> I, I, can, I can try it out. I will. Right off. Thank you for your yeah, meditation. I'm already on on uh, inside timer with some meditation uh, sessions, but you know the resonance isn't so huge. But they, they are in German. Maybe the audience, uh, German-speaking audience, is a little bit tinier. Um, I don't know. But thank you for mentioning it. I will try it out. Have a nice week. Until next time.
back to the still. Namaste. And back to the black. Bye bye. Okay. Collecting the stuff.